Hello everyone, it's Daniel again. For today, we're going to talk about a topic of in the event of emergency. In any sport that you understand, you must understand that there are bound to be circumstances that you will fall into a risk of accident. And when accident happens, there's a time where you need help or someone who needs definitely need your help when you're not involved in an accident. But first and foremost, it's always remember, when it comes to any accident or emergency, make sure that you're safe enough to carry out any safety or uh, procedure that you need to do without endangering yourself. So the first thing first, whenever any accident that happens, assess the situation. Are you in the right environment or situation to provide or render your help toward the victims or even to yourself? If you were fell in the middle of the road, first thing you do is to make sure that no ongoing vehicles. Even if there is, try to make sure that you are able to wave on, tell the vehicle to slow down or to give way so that you do not hit the victims or yourself if you are injured. In the event that you fell down, you find that there is something that which is not right. Being it, it could potentially be your spine or concussion to your head. The best way is not to move the victim at all. It's best that you call 995 and seek for so-called expert help, then over-exert the victim unnecessarily. So in the event that you find that the injury is something that's superficial, take for example like retro, bleeding, or some sort of, uh, you know, tension into your skin, what you can apply, of course, is the RISE methodology where they say that rest the victim, compress the area, which is so-called as an injured, make sure that there's no, take a look, observe it, Make sure if there's no bone injuries or anything, right? Put some compress. Because in the middle of the cycling, I don't expect anyone to carry a box of ice, right? To put the ice or uh, compress it onto the wood. But what you can do is that you can always elevate the area of the wood or bleeding, compress it, right? So this will help in the for the time, uh, to buy the time so that the ambulance can arrive to the victim. That's all for I have for now, because this is really based on my experience that I have. For myself, I fell on my own times. I've also seen a victim of fell. But in any way, the first thing first, prevent any accident from happening. Observe, stay away from hazard and always communicate. In the event when you need to go fast, be diligent. Look around to make sure that you are away from any hazard, you are not in any endangering yourself position and make sure all the time, ride safety so that you can enjoy it.